Hey guys, this is Vicki. Welcome back to my channel. I wanted to share with you a small haul that I did. I stopped off at Hobby Lobby. I was checking to see if they had completed their uh, markdowns um, on some of the dies and if they had marked down any of the Copic markers. I'm looking for some a great deal on those. I see where people are sharing that. Um, I did stop and look into the die section and um, first I went to the Copic area and they hadn't marked those Copic markers down yet so I scooted on over to the um, to the die area to see if they've marked down some of that stuff and they have they have done some of their uh, dies and some of the punches so let me get started and share with you what I picked up first off um, I got this Christmas tree. It was $4.24, normally $16.99. I thought that was a great deal. I couldn't pass that up. Um, I don't think I have that, but I picked this one up and then I picked up this deer one. I thought that was really cute. Could use the antlers for something else. So I got that. And again, $4.24. Um, Next, I went to just right across the aisle and I saw where Sizzix had this Tim Holtz butterfly die to $4.99, marked from $19.99. And I thought this had been out, but it hasn't been out very long, maybe a year or two, but they've got it marked on clearance. So I picked that up. And then next, they had some of their spell binders. Um, this one is um, Blooming Floral Wreath, and I wasn't going to get it, and I thought for $22, $5, can't beat it, you know, but that's what it looks like when it's done, and you could, and I thought the flowers are cute, if anything, just for the flowers, so, but I picked that up, and I figured I could either make a wreath or cut this in half and just stick it in different, you know, areas on a card or tag or whatever but I got that and then I picked up this um, tiger oh my and I meant to grab the other one too there was a um, I can't remember what the other animal was but and I meant to grab it because I was looking at it it was the lion that so I grabbed the tiger and I should have grabbed the lion too but I didn't so this was normally three dollars I mean fourteen ninety nine for three seventy four to, marked down to three dollars and it was marked down to three dollars and seventy four cents so I thought can't beat that um, next I got this other spell binders die it was the Tierra Rondell and I liked it for this here and then when I saw what it looks like in the back what it makes I thought that is cute 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 so I grabbed that um, I also saw where they had this. It's undo. It's a remover. It removes, you know, adhesives, tapes, gum, tar, crayon, lip balm, grease, and more. So I thought for $2.99 from normally $11.99, I couldn't beat that. So I, I picked this up. And then I had seen this before at another um, Hobby Lobby, and it wasn't... I thought, wow, you know, should I or shouldn't I? I thought, well, just just wait. So I ended up going to another Hobby Lobby, the one that's closer to where I live. And I remember seeing this particular stapler marked. I mean, it was tore up and they tried to tape it back up. And I thought, for $4.24, I will buy that. I do have the Tim Holtz small, um, the mini stapler, but I figure for something big or just to have down here in my craft room I couldn't pass that up for four dollars and twenty four cents so I grabbed that and then they also had um, these little waterfalls uh, photo sleeves for a dollar forty nine from five dollars and ninety nine cents and I thought those would be great to have to even make um, little shakers or you know whatever but I couldn't pass that up so I got two of those and they also had um, 
this here, which is the fuse, these are the decorative tips. And uh, for $2.49 from $9.99. And I thought that's a good deal. So I have the fuse, and I figure I would add that to my collection for the fuse. Um, and here's another Spellbinders die that I had picked up. This one says, but coffee, but first coffee. And look at how cute. So I picked that up. I thought that was really cute to have. So for $3, I picked that up. And then next, they had these um, thermal laminating, laminating pouches. I'm trying to make sure there's no glare. These laminating pouches here from Scotch. And they were $1.24. So I picked two of them up. That was the last two they had. And I thought those would be great to have. And then um, their Paper Studio paper pads were on sale, but this one wasn't, and I forgot to use my coupon on it. But it was $6.99 for this flawless 6x6 um, six six paper pad by uh, Authentique. And I don't think I've got this paper pad. I'm trying not to buy any more paper, but these little bitty ones I can handle more than, or store easier than the 12x12. 12 12. So I got that. And then I went to the uh, jewelry section and Timeline, the jewelry, was on sale for 50%. So I thought these would look cute um, on some earrings. So I got that. And then I picked these up here. All these were um, half off. I can, these are all tangled up. Hang on. Okay. I thought those would look cute on as earrings as well. And uh, those were half off as well from $4.99. So I picked these two up. And then um, I walked over to the um, where they sell the bags and the hats and the shirts. And I picked up this hat. It is basically yours. And right now, this stuff is um, on sale, 50% uh, off, I think. So I got this here. And I got it because I have my, um, what is it? Let me go get it. Well, I'll show you in a minute. It's my um, mini Easy Press. So I'm going to make something here to put on there and try it out. My hat got a little dirty in the back, but yeah, so I thought that was a cute, this is an adult hat, so we'll try that and see. And I picked up this shirt here. I love these shirts. Um, this is a shirt that I got from Hobby Lobby. I got this for my mother. I am going to um, make her a... She wants a shirt that says Tennessee on it, so I'm, I'm going to make that for her. Cut that out on my Cricut Maker or my Cricut Air, whichever I have um, access to at the time. And then I'll use my the Easy Press too. I got I got that in mint for my birthday, and I haven't shared that, but that's what I got. So I'm going to try that out too. Well, I did try it out on my uh, grandson's T-shirt that I made for him, and I'll share that maybe later in another video. And then I got this other shirt here. I love this color. There was another lighter color that I would have liked to have had, but they uh, they were uh, out. I just saw it in, in a smaller um, t-shirt. I didn't. I needed it in a two X, and I I didn't have it. But this shirt's not for me. It's for somebody else. So I'm gonna make them a shirt. So I got these, and these were $14.99. And they were 30% off. And then um, I think this one was $12.99. I thought I saw a tag or something on it. But anyway, they were 30% um, off. So, uh, And then let me show you my um, mini. Hang on. Okay, before I share my mini with you, I also walked over to the Christmas aisle there. And there were some things I was going to pick up and start, you know, for decorating. And I thought, I don't need any more because... When it's all said and done, I have to find storage for that stuff. And I'm tired of, I don't want to do that. I don't want to keep so much Christmas and my attic is overflowing as it is now. 
but I got these cute little um, coasters here. I got these from Hobby Lobby. I love Cardinals and they're for my car. Um, so when the holidays come, these were I think 40% off and um, I got them to put inside my car for the holidays. So I got those. I really love, like I said, Cardinals. But next, um, let me, oh, one more thing. Here is this, look at how cute. I got this at Hobby Lobby. It is Christmas cheer foaming hand soap. And I got this to go in my um, half bath. Um, normally it was $9.99 and I think it was 40% off. So I wish I could smell it, but you can't smell it. So I'm hoping it smells good. But I liked it because of the, um, the vintage looking animals. So I got that. And while I was also in the Christmas section, I picked these cute deer up. They are um, by the Christmas shop and they were normally $14.99 and they were 40% off. And my thing was, um, I was gonna spray paint them either white or maybe even gold or silver to go on my, um, either my big tree or my tree that's gonna go into my um, bedroom that I put up every year um, in my uh, big tree in my living room is gonna, it's red and white. I'm not gonna change it up this year, but just keep it the same as I did last year. So I thought, like I said, I'll spray paint these and then maybe put like a little saying right here is like says believe uh, magic or Christmas or, or believe in Christmas. I don't know. I don't know if I'll have enough room, but that's, that was my plan. So I just wanted to show those. Now, next, here is my Cricut Easy Press Mini. I haven't used it yet, but um, I picked this up at Walmart for 49 or $48. I had to go to another um, Walmart um, to, to get it. I mean, it wasn't far from my, I mean, it was kind of far, but my son lived in the area and I went to go visit him. But, um, when I got there, the girl said she couldn't find it. It had them in stock, but they just hadn't put them out. So the lady went back and, and found it. I looked in the clearance section and I looked in the iron section and I looked in the fabric section and it wasn't out, but she did find it in the back and she gave that to me. And because I waited, while she looked, she gave me a dollar off. So it was 49, but marked it down to 48. But look at how cute that is. I'm so excited. How cute. I wasn't going to get it, but I thought for that price, I can't beat that. And I saw where some people were getting in it for $22 on clearance because Walmart didn't know what to do with it. They thought it was discontinued. And that's what the lady told me too. She goes, it shows like it's discontinued, but whatever. I got it. Well, anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you're having a great day, and um, I appreciate you uh, watching my videos and taking the time out of your day to do that. Thank you so much, and have, have a great day. Bye for now.